So I just spent another night camping and sleeping on the Big Agnes Circle Back Pad and figured it was time to give it a review. This is the guy. I like it. So what makes this sleeping pad unique is that it is a bladder, which, you know, like a regular type sleeping pad inside of this insulated cover. So together, the R value is actually pretty decent. It's 4.7. So you could take this into fall. Indeed, I slept on this for a couple of nights around mid 40 degree lows and um, it felt just fine. Uh, my sleeping bag probably wasn't warm enough, but that's another story. <laughs> but those combination of parts kind of make this a pretty unique sleeping pad. For starters, uh, because the interior pad is made of TPU instead of um, the stuff that Big Agnes's pads are usually made out of, uh, it, it's a little bit stretchy, which means that there's going to be a little bit more give in the pad, even when you have it fully inflated, which is going to make it feel more like um, a traditional mattress. It's obviously not still a traditional mattress, so keep that in mind when setting expectations but that little bit of stretch does seem to make a bit of a difference in comfort and then you have the insulated pad cover which is filled with uh big agnes's recycled fireline eco insulation so the insulation in here is 100 percent recycled which is great in addition to helping maintain the uh r value and the warmth rating of this pad that also makes it actually quite a bit more comfortable to sleep on um, and that's with or without a sleeping bag. Um, I did sleep on this on one fairly warm night and I just slept straight on it with a quilt over top of me and that was way more comfortable than sleeping with my quilt um, on top of like you know a plasticky feeling uh, sleeping pad um, and yes the pad cover is removable and washable so good to note. It also makes the whole pad quieter. Uh, so like when I move around when I'm sleeping, it's making less noise than when I would do so on like this kind of pad, which Big Agnes pads aren't terribly crinkly or crunchy, which is nice uh, to begin with, but this one's even quieter. So that's cool. <laughs> like if you're sharing a tent with a buddy, But the main selling feature for this pad is not that it's all just comfort and whatever. That's all nice. This pad is also fully recyclable. Now I didn't get into details with Big Agnes, but they do say that you can send in this pad at the end of its life and they will recycle it into something new. Uh, now, materials recycling like that is still a bit tricky to actually accomplish, but Big Agnes is inviting you to go ahead and send it in whenever it's ready. And that's, you know, hopefully after you patch it because it does come with TPU patches in case you get a small leak somewhere that's easy to do yourself. And it comes with a pump sack that's made out of the same TPU material so you don't have to use your mouth though there is a microbial uh, coating on the inside of the pad in case you would rather use your lungs to inflate it and of course their warranty still applies so you can still send the pad in if it gets a um, larger hole or there's a hole around the valve something like that um, you can send the pad back into Big Agnes to be repaired which is awesome and we've encouraged family members to do that before and it's beautiful and I love that Big Agnes does that so Hopefully you should be keeping this pad in play for a very long time, but at the end of its life, when it's ready to be retired, when it just can't be patched anymore or springs a gigantic leak, you can send it in and they will recycle it, which is super cool and keeps more things out of landfills, which is awesome. Now, this is not a backpacking sleeping bag. You could feasibly use it as such, but it's a bit heavy. It's not really much larger than a lot of Big Agnes's other pads, so if you already backpack with one of their sleeping pads, uh, then you'll probably be fine. It's a smidge heavier. So the smaller version of this pad, and there are two sizes, um, regular and long. Um, the regular version weighs 34 ounces, uh, which for me, an ultra lighter, is too heavy <laughs> for backpacking. But for camping, I love this and if you would rather carry a few extra ounces or almost 
pounds uh, when it comes to this pad when you're backpacking, then that's totally up to you and I support you in your heaviness. But I do love this for car camping when I'm just like driving to a campsite and unloading stuff from my car and uh, I wanna sleep comfortably. Hence the um, blackout tent that is also not backpacking friendly. <laughs> we reviewed the Decathlon two second easy up tent and we'll put a link to that review in the description below. There you have it. That's the Big Agnes circle back pad and comfort, yes. Quiet, yes. Warm, yes. It's even pretty dang packable. And it can be recycled at the end of its life. It's basically a win all around, in my opinion. So I can highly recommend two thumbs up. As always, thanks for watching and stick around for even more reviews. Feel free to give this video a thumbs up and, and hit subscribe. It actually really helps our little channel grow. We appreciate it. Then get out there, sleep on something comfortable for crying out loud and wander on.